Nothing but rubble remains of a South Dakota home after natural gas leak causes a deadly explosion. This next video, some of the most incredible you will ever see. Martin says she was traveling northbound on Kickapoo Road on her motorcycle when she came across this huge sinkhole. I've got there experience, go. all right? We'll guide you through this. Sorry, was that a donut on a hot dog there in that video? Because somebody's getting hungry. I'm going to need a minute. <laughs> a few people can say they've been shot in the head and survive. Even fewer can say they've been shot and didn't notice for five years. Is that right? Is, that it, you're really, is it really 510 right <laughs> now? I can't believe they're actually letting me do this. <laughs> All right, now that was a little excessive, I thought. <laughs> the metal bars on this fence are bent in the direction the wind was going. And then you can also track more of it as you can see it on the ground, as it's like fingernail marks with debris and this trailer here that's scraped across the ground. I will be there, speedo, chest hair, a blazing man. Don't you worry. You don't want to miss that. <laughs> Absolutely, Crash. Thank you so much Thanks for coming, for man. Us. We appreciate it. Hi, I'm here with Bitter and Jaded. <laughs> My name's Matt. Glad to have you with us this morning. <laughs> Only 145 days until Christmas. Yeah, it's still a long ways off. Unless, of course, you find yourself at Selfridge's department store in London. In that case, hey, Christmas is already here. 13 year olds charged in a juvenile court after he throws acid on two preteens. The teen's accused of heinous battery and has been turned over to juvenile court for processing. An eight week old kitten is recovering from injuries he received after possibly getting thrown from a car. Well, Angie, two arrests in Canada and police say they're terror related. Canadian police aren't giving much information, but according to authorities, suspects were plotting to use explosives. Some locals are surprised by the arrest, while others say they can see the potential targets. Here's a new one for you. Female thief uses men's underwear to rob the Golden Arches. Seriously, check out this woman in the surveillance video here. Looks like she prefers briefs over boxers, using them along with paper clips to make a mask and keep it in place. The chief says the brief bearing bandit Still on the run. If you recognize the woman, don't know how you would <laughs> call mid, or if you recognize the underwear, <laughs> call Midwest City Police 739 1306. Coming up on Fox 25 Morning News, we get down to the nitty gritty. We're going to talk about what men really mean uh -oh. when they say certain things. Ooh. It's like a translator. Yeah. Well, this sounds like something you would do, Angie. In Ohio, police say a woman called 911 looking for love. I'm just kidding, of course. Audrey Scott, she was convicted of a misdemeanor charge after placing a hoax call to 911. Officers say, call 911, ask the operator to find her a husband. Not only that, she called five times within an hour. Are these tips. Seriously? Yes. Preparation H on your thighs. Okay. That's, I just no read that's the normal. I just read the <laughs> I want to see somebody out there sunbathing <laughs> with the preparation H rubbing on their Honey, thighs. Could you please, no one would even know. Can you please uh, <laughs> Yeah, could you just hand put the preparation the, the H on my preparation just right around H. here oh. for me? Well, a man in Massachusetts who thought he had cancer actually had something very different affecting his health. A crazy story here. He had a pea growing inside his lung. Seriously, a pea. Doctors say he must have swallowed it, but it went down the wrong pipe and began to grow inside his lung. The man's recovering from surgery to remove the plant. His neighbors have sent him pea seeds and canned peas all just in good fun. Wow, that is... Congratulations oh, yeah. to all the kids out there who never have to eat peas again. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Six women recovering after industrial silicone used in their butt enhancement surgeries. Are we serious today? Am I, am I really on the news right now? For stars like J-Lo, Kim Kardashian, and Beyonce, it's a very valuable asset. <laughs> and to get this look, some ladies pay six grand or more for these butt implants.